my god! Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. I'm happy to have you here today. It's a girl, it's a girl, JC. It's Judith Caleb. That's my name. My name is Judith Caleb. Thank you so much for stopping by to watch this video. And you know how we do it. You know how we do it. If this is your first time watching my video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. So please, 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 please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Thank you. So today I'm going to be watching Kayayana uh, stand up comedy. You know, German humor, German humor, German humor. It's all about German humor. I've been watching um, a lot of videos about, about Kapispa's video. I've watched like um, his dark humor. And so today I'm going to watch Kaya Yana. You know, let us see, let us see. So, guys, without further ado, without further ado, you know how we do it. Let us watch. Are you guys ready? Listen up, are you ready for this? We are ready. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kaya. I'm a Turkish comedian who was born and raised in Germany and who performs in English. Now you might ask yourself, what's your problem? Well, I think the thing is this. Uh, uh, Germany is a, is a great country which exports a lot of things like beer, cars, software. And why not comedy? And why not a Turkish comedian? Because it all started 50 years ago when the Turks came to Germany. Uh, as you all know, we had a Second World War in 1945. Europe was in ruins because everyone bumped the shit out of each other. So a lot of, a lot of men died. A lot yeah. of people died in the Second World War and a lot of workforce. So the Germans, the French, everyone involved in the Second World War was looking for workers. And everyone was looking in their respective colonies. So the French had colonies in Northern Africa. So they looked for workers over there. The English had colonies in India. So they brought a lot of Indian people to England. <laughs> the Germans didn't have any colonies. They were trying to establish colonies in Europe. <laughs> so, <laughs> so they asked uh, for uh, different countries. They asked uh, it Italy, they asked uh, Portugal, and Turkey. So a lot of Turks said, yeah, sure, why not? We go to Germany, we work two, three years, and then we go back. And that was the contract. The Germans said, okay, you come here for work, two, three years, and then you fuck off again. Okay, no problem. After two or three years, the truck said, thank you very much, here is the money, okay, thank you, we go. And then the German said, no, can you stay two more years? We got a lot of Aufschwung over here. <laughs> we got a lot of work, can you stay two more years? Okay, no problem, we stay two more years. So we stayed five years in general, in common. Okay, let's go, we leave. But no, wait, hold on a second, <laughs> we still have a lot of Arbeit for you, can you come back? So we stayed after 10 years, we said, listen, we like your country and we like the Arbeit and we like the, the payment, but we're a little bit bored. Can we bring our wives? And you guys said yes. And that was a mistake. <laughs> because if there's one thing we Turks can do is multiply. <laughs> That's true. 1950s, there were 100,000 Turks. Just 100,000 Turks in Germany. Now it's 2011. We have 3 million Turks. Wow, that's a we lot. We can multiply. We can... <laughs> and I'm one of those 3 million. Right now, I'm 38 years old. And personally, I'm uh, looking for Miss Yanar. You know? Yeah, personally, I'm looking for my wife. Uh, she exists somewhere. I'm pretty sure she does. Not only in my mind. And I want to find her quickly. Because it's thir I'm 38. I'm heading towards 50. And I can feel it, that my body is deteriorating. I see my, my hair is falling out. And it, it starts to grow in places I've never seen it before. 
that there's, there's hair on my neck and on my shoulder and on my back. And look at my feet, I could double hobbits. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, there's hair everywhere. And when I bend down to tie my shoelaces, you know, I sound like a Chinese Kung Fu master. What? What? <laughs> if there's a Chinese guy behind me, he feels challenged. No, I'm, it's my shoelace. Stop it. And now I'm trying to find Miss Yana, okay? And uh, I'm looking all over the place. I, I didn't find her in Germany. So I thought, okay, maybe look somewhere else. Like Scandinavia, because that's my type. My type is blonde, blue-eyed, and tall, and that's the mm. woman I like. You know, you know why? Because I want to you know, mix the DNA. I want to mix the genes. I, I don't want to... My mother says, please marry a Turkish woman. Marry a Turkish woman. But I tell to my mom, listen, if I marry a Turkish woman, we have Turkish kids. It never changes anything. I want to mix it all around, you know? <laughs> And then the opposite to me is tall, blonde, and blue-eyed. And that's why I'm looking in Scandinavia, like Denmark. Copenhagen is a beautiful town. I love Denmark. I love Danish women. But now it gets a little bit complicated, okay? She not only has to be good-looking, and she not only has to love me, but she also has to sound sexy. So the language is important. The dialect or accent, if she does have any, is very important. Wow, and the voice. A lot. And that's where the Danish screw it up a little bit, because the Danish have a, have a letter. It's a cross-out O. And it's pronounced, uh. <laughs> I'm not exaggerating. That's, that's the sound of uh. red pudding with vanilla sauce in Danish means. Uh. What? You, say, what you, can, you can look like a top model, but if you go uh, on me, I get scared. And it's got, I got the same problem with uh, Cro uh, Croatian people. Any Croatians here in the house? From Croatia? Nothing? Jesus. Huh? Serbia. Does it count? Is it the Serbo-Croatian language? Could you say that? Is it sort of the same words? Because the, the Croatian language, it ruins it for me. Because Croatia is a nice country, and I, I like Croatian women. There are a few beautiful ones. But the problem is... <laughs> there are a lot of beautiful ones. <laughs> but, uh, but the problem is the language. It ruins it for me. I mean, if, if the, the Croatian language is a little bit schizophrenic. They have words with lots of vowels, and then there's words without any, just consonants. I don't know if you can imagine that, but if you could surf the Croatian language, okay, and the vowels would be the waves, you could write the language quite good. <laughs> and then there's a sandbank of consonants. I'm not exaggerating. Oh What's my your name? God, this guy is so Maria. funny. Maybe it's the same. What? I, I, know the, the, I know the words already, but maybe oh, it's the same language. How am I just seeing him for the first Croatian. time? What does garden mean in Croatian language? Garden. Basta. Vrt. <laughs> See, I'm not, I'm not lying. <laughs> I'm not lying. It's a vrt. It's a word. Vrt. It's VRT, Vrt. Where are you going? Vrt, bless you. No, vrt. <laughs> vrt. The next word, okay? Death. It's serious. You have to pay respect to death. You don't know what's going to happen. Some people are afraid of death, okay? So death is a very heavy word. In German, it's Tod. And you think, oh shit, what's happening with Tod? It's death. And Croatians say, Smrt. <laughs> you can't call death Smrt. You just go. Everyone laughs at smrt. It's like a comic word. It's like you drive over something. <laughs> smrt. What was that? What was that? Shit. Oh, shit. Smrt. What happened? What? 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 You can't call death smrt. <laughs> Let's say if I live in Croatia and the Grim Reaper would come and get me. I, I couldn't get him. Sorry, I couldn't take him seriously. He would knock on my door. <laughs> It's me. Oh my god. Smith. I would go ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Poor Smith. Did they steal your vowels? Yes. I wanted to be called smart. <laughs> my god. I'm really 
really sorry. I need to calm myself down because this is too much. I don't know why I'm just like, this is the first time I'm watching him. This is the first time I'm watching him. And it's just so funny. It's funny. It's jokes. It's me. <laughs> My God. Anyway. Anyway, I, I enjoyed this. I laugh. Like, I'm still laughing. Like, like I'm trying not to tear up because it's like, I'm laughing so hard. Tears are going to start falling. But yeah, this is really fun. And I enjoyed it. And... Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed this reaction video. If you enjoyed this reaction video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Recommend videos for me to watch and react to. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm trying to get 10,000 subscribers. So please, please, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Bye. <laughs> my God.